Welcome to another video review and get ready for a very long title. Today I'm looking at the Crucial Ballistics PC3 12800 DDR3 triple channel 6 gigabyte smart tracer memory with LEDs. Okay, let me first open this memory, at least I'll try to. This is the traditional clamshell casing, but they are heat sealed all the way around. Of course, this is for security reasons, maybe. People won't take them out of the pack and seal them in store. However, they are extremely annoying to open. I wish uh, Crucial would, to be honest, come up with something a little bit different than this, something a little bit easier to open. You know, not too easy, but just a little bit easier than this. What you have to do is either get a pair of tin snips, I'm not exaggerating, to be safe, or a large pair of great scissors. Here goes. Wish me luck. If I bleed out here all over the place, forgive me. What I normally do is cut all the way around, or at least this far. Sorry for going off camera there. I'll just cut that far because it's enough to get it open. And the packaging itself is quite nice, black kind of gold theme to it. Um, information here on the front, premium memory. These are pretty generic uh, cases, to be honest. Uh, performance, uh, high performance memory with LEDs. On the back, some more information about it. The Crucial Ballistics Tracer memory is engineered for enthusiasts and system modders. This product features all of the benefits of ballistics memory, advanced speed grades, lower latencies, and heat spreaders, plus LEDs in several colors. 100% motherboard tested and speed validated. Innovative, award-winning design. Activity indicating LEDs. Okay, so let's open it up and see what's inside. You know what? I'm going to have to go all the way around with this. You see how simple this is to open? And uh, if you don't cut in far enough, you can't get it open, so you got to cut again. I'm doing this just to uh, demonstrate. I love these packages. Oh, <laughs> yes, they're just great. Uh, no, no. Still got the cutting. Get it to the other side. I'll be done soon. I promise. Try and get in here. You can't cut too far, really, because you don't want to damage the memory. But if you don't cut far enough, you can't get it open. It really should not be this hard to get open. Okay, I'm finally in. Boy, that was hard. Inside here, it says, need help. For additional information on the product, warranty or return information, go to www.crucial.com slash support. And with it opened, finally, you can see three beautiful sticks of memory. Now, the reason why I have two packs here is one pack has different LED colors than the other one. I'll go into this a little later on. I will be opening this pack for testing, uh, but I'm not going to open it on camera because, well, it will just simply bore you. Uh, let me uh, take these out now and have a closer look. This is tri-channel or triple channel DDR3 memory. This is not dual channel memory, so you will need to have a triple channel DDR3 capable motherboard to install this type of memory. Now let me go over some of the specifications. This is lead free memory with XMP. It's 1600 megahertz and has a timing of 88824. The heat spreader is aluminum and it does look very sharp. It has this brushed aluminum silver border black interior and the normal 
orange yellow ballistics color theme it works quite well now the heat spreader on this might not be as robust as some of their other memory or for that matter other companies memory that you know has this massive heat spreader and the heat sink fins on the top and so on and so forth you know when you have that it will perform a little bit better in the sense that it will be a little bit cooler but the problem with having memory that has fins you know that stick up quite a distance is it might actually interfere with installing a cooler this won't because it's the standard DDR3 size. Now, if you look really closely, you can see the LEDs at the top of the memory, and this kit comes with two different color options, and there's also another kit with two more color options. So the LEDs at the top will be red and green, or the other kit would be orange and blue, and you get, of course, which one would match your kind of, you know, computer setup theme you want to have some other lights and so on and so forth inside of the case remember that this is ballistics smart tracer it features these activity indicating leds so you know when there's activity going on when the memory is being used they will just go crazy now this also comes with ground effects leds along the bottom and as well there is a downloadable mod or mod utility and I'll show you that it can, you know, monitor uh, real-time temperature and more. You can see that this particular kit has green ground effects. And by the way, this orange LED you're seeing is on the motherboard. That's not the memory. And as you can see here, blue LEDs at the top of the memory. Okay, so let's now have a look at the other kit. Green ground effects and green at the top now let's see what all of these different colors look like together would recommend though getting the same color if you're actually buying a lot of this memory so here it goes let's turn the system on and see yeah not too bad green and blue and as you can see the more activity the faster that these little leds fly all over the place okay let me have a really in-depth look at this memory overview display utility first of all the data it shows you all kinds of data for every single module that you have installed it shows you the device type capacity part number banks ranks memory bus width also the timings as well as the profile including the memory speed, the voltage, and the clock frequency. Also temperature. It shows you the temperature of each module that you have installed. This is where it gets really, really neat. You can change the pattern from stereo to inside out to lava to streamer. You can also adjust the brightness as well as changing the colors on the LEDs. Remember I mentioned there's two kits currently available. One is red green and the other one is orange blue and you can do this real time in this area. And settings where you can change the unit from Celsius to Fahrenheit. You can also adjust the chart update rate as well as the file update rate. You can also do different actions when the memory reaches a certain temperature, like for example, if it reaches 60 degrees, well, you can then have a balloon tip notification or you can flash the LEDs, of course, if you have memory that is equipped with LEDs. Also, uh, this is kind of like the top limit, uh, you know, of the memory where you want it to uh, either shut down your computer system or flash the uh, LEDs as well. You can also show the temperature widget and you can adjust the transparency of that particular widget. And finally, about, which just gives you more information about the ballistics utility. <laughs> Thank you. 
Now, since this is triple channel memory and it's a six gigabyte kit, each module is two gigabytes each. And one kit should be enough for most folks. If you're into really, really memory intensive applications like video editing, you know, doing 3D graphics and that type of thing, get more. If you're just doing gaming, one kit should be enough. But keep in mind that you do need to have a motherboard that supports triple channel DDR3 memory. Now this memory overall performs really, really well, but of course there is faster memory on the market, but all things considered performance, cost, look, LEDs, kind of cool stuff. It's a kick-ass product. Until next time, take care.